Where the fuck is Max at? I miss him. If I had a wish, oh, I'll, I'll wish it right now. Oh. Yeah, something, something crazy. Karma's a bitch. Fuck. You don't know the rest, do ya? But do you know the fucking rest? Are you a hardcore JoJo fan? You fuck. I never have seen JoJo. Yeah. Are, are we talking about the same thing here? You mean the anime, right? No, talk JoJo Siwa. What the fuck you want about? Uh, d gee, don't. Are we getting close like that, huh? Yeah, I don't know how close we are yet. I, I would say we're pretty close. I would say, sadly enough, we are indeed close. Damn. Okay, I see how. It I is. see. I see things of yours that I cannot unsee. Hey, man. It's all about the memories we make along the way. I, I guess. All right. Uh, you guess. No, to make my. I want a long enough mustache for me to like properly twirl, you know? Mm. That's why I shave and put oil on so it gets thicker and thicker every time I get hair longer. I, I can't do that. I do not want to shave this shit in the fear of it's just, you know, I not coming you. back. You scaredy cat. Well, I am scared. Like, that's a really fearful thing. Like, if I shave my mustache, what will I become? Hitler. What of me still exists? This mustache is the only thing that keeps me from being alive. It's my, it's my well-being. I wake up, I pray to this mustache, and I go, damn. If you weren't, if you weren't around, where would I be? Constantly. What will become of me without this mustache? Brain juice. Uh, so, it's you know, not your brain, it's your skull. Don't ruin my fucking belief that I have a really cool long brain, alright? Don't I couldn't. I couldn't brain. shave my hair, bro. I have so many different like cracks and indents in my skull. I think that's oh, okay. Of course, sounds painful. They're as meant fuck. to kind of be there. Yeah. When you're a kid, your skull isn't fully connected together, so you can become a cone, so you can get out of your mom. Um, because sometimes they're really small. Yeah, and then you have a soft spot. Third is well, your brain if someone touches it and then later your um brain well your skull sutures together and so you have a bunch of cracks and small indents because of those sutures and that's why you can't leave a baby to lay on their back for too long why mm. do people get headaches like why is that a thing um, because you have different nerves um around and stress and sinuses oh. and pressure. Hear me out. There's like a tiny little man, like really skinny little guy. Like that goes in your, in your head. head. It, yeah. Flicks you guys. This is the man under the bed, bro. He goes in your head too. Exactly. Uh, he's a he's a guy of multiple, you know, whims. You this know? is why Fuck. He's the reason so, so you, the my entire stopped, bro. childhood was riddled with headaches. Yep. Is that guy. Xanax yeah, headaches a lot. Some light quill and uh some heroin. Really I get you going. So many headaches. Do you think Victorian children had these modern technology? No, they. That's why they died when they were like one. <laughs> no, not true. A lot of them were like Dude. inbreded, though. They were inbred. The tumor. Inbred. They were like, just tried bloodletting, some leeches. Or leeches are still actually used to this day because they, they are, are a good method for another oh, clean. Yep. Or heroin. Heroin? Oh, no. what is yeah. Heroin does not clean wounds. Have you tried it? Dude, why would I try <laughs> heroin? Fair enough, I What's guess. The you know yeah, what? You That's so true. Have you, have tried, you it, tried heroin yet? Uh, heroin. Fuck. Heroin. You haven't. Snorling. How do you first get herpes? How, like, without, like well, how does it start? <laughs> it starts normally. A, a night out? <laughs> well, it's a transmitter. I mean, like, yeah, what's each? It's transmitted, but like, how did it start in the first who place? Was, like, are you asking like who got the first herpes? Yeah, who's That's... who's patient zero, bro? <laughs> bro, that was you probably like how many not years ago? No, yeah. like, hundreds of thousands of years ago. Well, like, how the skin? How did herpes become herpes? Oh, how did anything become anything, mate? We <laughs> yeah, back in I the day, people were wild. Yeah, 
it, it, it's rather we ate, we fucked, or we sp <laughs> like it's either that. Honestly, we ate, we or well, it's not really eating. It's well, like maybe you just ingesting. About it. If we didn't have diseases like we do, yeah. we would suffer from severe over overpopulation. That's true. That's so it's a population why control. Herpes is a good thing. That's why we should play Russian roulette. No. Tell us who's with me. Uh, no, because we are no. actually suffering from underpopulation. That's the only room. reason the U.S. isn't suffering is because we have immigration. But countries who don't have immigration are actually seeing a decrease. The only exception is India. That's mm -hmm. why they're paying people to move to countries. Mm -hmm. I want to move to Yo. Norway. Go for it. Alright, bye guys. Mama's getting me some Mickey D's. Well, me and Max want to move to Switzerland, probably. Switzerland. I heard their insurance is really nice, or their health care is really nice. Oh, it's not that, it's date and time settings. What the fuck am I doing? Maybe Japan for a little bit. Japan for a little bit, but the language barrier would be kind of weird. Japan. Maybe a visit would be nice, but not. I wouldn't be able to stay there. It's also Maybe like hard. for a few years, not like forever. It's actually really well, hard to like... live in Japan as like a as a immigrant. They and have they bars where you. it's only exclusive for Japanese people. It's not even bars. It's just like you know they have places where you can't go. They're in trying to of, like you... there's a group of people that are trying to like talk to the government about that. Well, the one place that they're trying to shut down is because tourists kept on harassing them. So I mm -hmm. get that. That's I think understandable. It's funny, bro. That's very understandable. <sighs> I bet it was Americans, not gonna it, lie. <laughs> nah, it's, it's no, it was just us. all foreigners in general. Yeah. Well, then, ja like, it's like, uh, like, a like, Japan does that to, like, other people, too, and it's funny. Like, they'll just come up and start taking pictures with you. Yeah. Like, they'll touch you, and it's like, you, but we do, like... I don't fucking touch hypocrites. me, I have a gun. I have a gun? Nah, you can't even bring guns over there, bro, they're strict as fuck. Yeah. There you are. There. I yeah, having a, I think, yeah, having a, either, like, a, a firearm is illegal. Mm-hmm. In Japan. The food there is Gambling is so illegal in Japan, too. Well, I don't have a problem with that, because I don't My gamble. Addiction, no. <laughs> so, set time... I would uh, like yeah. to, like, go as a holiday visit to Japan and Korea, but I don't mm -hmm. think I would ever want to live there. Oh, yeah, Maybe for like a doing. few years, you know, learn a different language. That's something yeah. that would be yeah. good. Honestly, I don't think. I believe the international language for trade is like other than English is Mandarin. Mm. Yeah, a lot of people know Mandarin. Mandarin. There's um, yeah. U.S. and China are the main driving force in the economy right now. Yep. There's lots of interesting things about the human fucking body that I love. And just about like autonomy in general. Like a long time ago, there was like, I don't know if a study, it was a borderline, uh, this mad doctor science experiment where they took two monkeys, decapitated one of them, and of course put his, like, what is it, attached to the blood vessels and cords and everything like that to the other monkey. And that, and that monkey, monkey had two monkeys. die months. in like a month. I believe so, but at the same yeah. time too, for that, like, that's fucking insane right there. Well, you want to know the coolest thing that recently happened in science? Please the tell. Sheep. So, there was this pig that was genetically modified to have a human-like heart, and then oh, yeah. the pig was raised and then died, and his heart was given to a terminally ill patient, and he lived for another two months before passing. That's pretty fucking cool. Wait, because of the heart or something else? Oh, because of the heart. He was gonna die either way. Oh, okay. They were just buying him time. Well, that's still pretty cool. Two months, you know, if yeah. I keep working. Because, like, if we can make so we can genetically modify animals in certain ways, then we wouldn't have to harvest humans. Yeah. We the activists are not gonna be happy. Organs, because, like, we are a different but it would solve the deficit of not having the organs that we did. Yeah, and there will probably also be, like, help with, like, illegally harvesting organs. They'll probably drop a lot less. Mm -hmm. Mm. And it also, with genetically modifying these animals, it's not animal cruelty because they are living their best possible life. 
life because we need the organs to be at the best quality they can be at. Mm -hmm. That's really so sad not... that that's the only reason they're going to have a good life because we need them. That's well, yeah. honestly, yeah. What are we talking about? Animals. 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 They're yummy. They're Bacon's yeah. pretty good. I love ham. All oh, ham is I was good. looking What's... at a piece of bacon at the store the other day, and I really had a moral debate about if I should buy this fucking Walmart bacon. I Just like, random. I, I'm not going to lie, but I love it when it says, Hi, my name is Clara, or something like that, when it's, and it shows a picture of the, of the cow you're about to eat. Honestly... Yeah. <laughs> it reminds me of the Coke products where you have to look for your name, I'm not gonna lie. You're so fucking weird, man! Sorry, were we talking no. about how it's sad we're using though, and I'm just being- Oh, weird. fuck no. I don't care. Well, as in like- I, I just walked into a vegan room real quick and I saw that oopsie daisy. I'm not entirely sure how I feel about, like, this shit anymore. I mean, so you, you eat what you wanna eat, I'm gonna eat what I wanna I'll eat. eat. No, of course. Don't try to shame me. Oh, hell no. My biggest thing with how animals are handled is, like, sometimes they're in, like, really nasty environments. And yes. I'm, like, I'm eating that thing. And Can't we uh -huh. just eat, eat the shit. ugly animals? Like, like pugs. I would not mind. I would eat a pug just for the experience. <laughs> just for the experience. I would be okay if pugs no longer existed. I would, yeah, I feel the same the way. Baby, those poor babies. Yeah, there's. They can't help it. They can't breathe. They would rather have a tube stuck in their nose to be able to breathe. I feel like or they should breed, like with a different animal that will help them. Chihuahuas. Or, yeah, we, we just would have to reverse breed. <laughs> yeah, to leave my chihuahuas alone. Nah, no, dude. We chihuahuas are a whole other issue. All right, can we talk yeah, about them or why they just? They're so angry for no. <laughs> That's what I'm saying. No. I'm gonna hug. So awful. So I'm gonna go lay down. All right, man. Take care of yourself, bro. Um, I'll probably be drink some fucking water. Nope. I'm gonna drink some water. And tea. Tea is another good solution, also. I tea, like tea is water flavored water. Hey, right, y'all going? You too. Take care of yourself. And then he waddled away. Waddle, waddle. waddle. Then he waddled yeah. away. Waddle, waddle. If you could give any animal a feature or a just adaptation, what animal would that be, and what feature would you give it? I would give dogs I'd give the ability up. to live to a hundred. A hundred? Because then they can be our best friend forever. But at the same time, too, though, just extending these poor animals' lives, like, they have to deal with, like, just going, being old and everything like that. We have to deal with being old. Well, yeah, but, like, these are dogs our here. Our old could be different from their old, though. Uh, yeah, but at the same well, time, I mean, too, like, like, give them, like, our own type of, like, lifespan type I of I see. Thing. Would they have the same genetic, genetic uh, we would have for them to be able to live for that long? <laughs> Fucking no! Wait, what genetic? What? Because Me? if I'm thinking about it this way, if we tr make a dog live to a hundred, and like a dog gets like very fucking like, you know, you ever see like an eleven year old dog running around like a like a baby would? No, it's, it's so like, cute. It's usually like run, not like slow being slow. Like, like, I mean, like extend their like adult life. Uh, okay. Yeah. I feel like I would give um, elephants and rhinos the ability to regrow back their horns. Oh, because yeah. of the poachers, horns, yeah. poachers yeah. that are cutting off their horns, well, tusks, I guess. You know what I'm trying to say. Yeah. Yep. I and see. they can't grow them back, so they die out because they can't protect themselves. Mm -hmm. I'm trying not to think of a funny answer. You know what? I would give uh, Pelicans the ability to unhinge your jaw like a snake. <laughs> You're fucking weird. I hate that. How much food they can eat like that? Just see like a fucking pelican like unhit your jog middle flight going down to pick up some fish. That'd be cool to see. I don't think it would. <laughs> it would be fucking interesting, but not really cool. Hey yeah, man, you said you can do anything. That's what I want. That's true. Hmm. I watched a snake eater frog before. Kind of oh, cool. west, the western diamondback snakes can jump up to 30 feet in the air. Oh, yeah. They coil themselves up and just, like, oh, my God. Like that's the coolest shit. Yeah. I love that. 